Hello ladies and gentlemen, this is Spike Riley here again we're going to start a brand new playthrough. My more from Power Rangers the Movie on the Sega Game Gear. Bam presto! Long ago and far away, a legendary interdimensional being known as Zordon came to the city of Angel Grove and established a vanguard in a never-ending struggle against evil. With the aid of his trusted assistant, Alpha Five, the noble master sought out six ex extraordinary teenagers and gave them the power to transform into a superhuman fighting force. In times of great need, the young heroes could now call upon colossal assault vehicles known as Power Zords. While the identity of these six remained a guarded secret, their courageous exploits soon became the stuff of legends, earning him the title Mighty Morphin Power Rangers. Yep, this is actually based on the movie. Durr. Okay, we've got story game versus game and link game, which is versus game two player. But we won't be able to do that. Capture the Power Rangers and bring them to my dimension of doom. So we got Lord Zed. Stage one, Bean Caster. Hmm. Okay. And as you can see, we actually got the same ones except Tommy is now. Who we're gonna play as is now a White Ranger. And as you can see, it's the same as Power Rangers on the Game Gear, on the very first Game Gear game. Yeah. Except Tommy's moves is different as the White Ranger game. Because. It's got this. Sort of attack like this. So do you can, and he can now, and his second attack is actually this. And now he fights mainly with Saba, a sword which he uses to summon the white tiger sword, which unfortunately, I'm going to tell you right now, is not playable in this version. Loser. I can't believe I'm spamming a bicycle kick. Yeah, bicycle kick of death. Who would have thought it, Durr? Now to finish him with the bicycle kick, or the Luke Kane kick, if you call it. I will finish those pesky Power Rangers off. Grow, grow, grow. Uh oh, growth bomb. And Bean Caster is now big. And yep, here come the Thunder's Megazord. Yep, like I said, it's the only Zord you're gonna get other than uh, Ninja Megazord. Power and a force, I don't know what I'm saying. Ow. And I'm gonna get my butt kicked. Ow. Yeah, so basically this is going to be the same as the other game, game on Power Rangers game on Game Gear, which I did. I 
I did on it oh, some time ago. Two hits. A great tornado projectile, and I punch him. Punch him out of the sky. Victory. Stage clear. And yep, Lord Zed's gonna say the same thing. Stage two, Goldar. Huh. Let's see. Who do we choose next? Okay, hmm, what we'll choose you, Rocky? Yeah, it's Rocky this time. Because at the time of the movie, Power Dresa will be in uh, Switzerland. Oh, hell yeah! If you play Power Rangers on the other Power Rangers Game Gear game, you'll see that his moves are like are the same thing. Ow! Ow! Wow! Even in easy mode, these putties are harder. Then again, there's Zed's putties. Oh, yeah, ooh. Now I'm gonna get my butt kicked here, huh? Ow! That thing, oh, that thing again. Ugh. Seriously, Goldar did that to me in the last game when during Politicorn. Well, this is his stage. Yeah, he's still too easy to beat. Victory for Rocky. I will finish those pesky powers off. Grow, grow, grow. <laughs> yep, another bomb. And yes, go to our hearts wings. Okay, now we gotta do it. So basically, for the Ranger segments, the White Ranger is the only new one because the new uh, okay. There we go. I mean, and this will fall. Yeah. Now to finish him, tornado it, because he is a lackey. As you saw, he gets up and escapes. Stage clear. Okay. We don't need to hear you again. We got the jaws of destruction. Okay, we're going to choose Tommy again. Since he's a little more different. Yeah, a little more different than his green ring counterpart from last game. I kinda like these putties for being these different putties. At least they're smarter. 
And they have more interesting death animation. Break it apart. And they're actually playing Tommy's battle theme from, from this TV series. here because he wants revenge for what happened. Uh. Okay. And here come the Jaws. The Jaws of D. The D is for, D is for destruction. much for the jaws of destruction. <laughs> Ooh, what this is, friend? 6,000 years ago, a morphological being known as Ivan Ooze ruled the world with a reign of unparalleled terror. He ran up the entire planet to their adult populations, then brainwashed the young to follow in his evil path. A faction of young warriors known as the Order of Meleden. Flared him into a hyperlock chamber and buried him deep underground. Present day, Angel Grove. An inner city construction crew accidentally uncovers the hyperlock chamber and releases the evil power of Ivan Ooze. Oh man, it's Boogerman again. Stage 4, Ooze Man. Lose a ooze, man. Okay, now we're starting to get to the 
actual movie part of the game, and we're going to stop the video right here. Until next time, this is Spike Riley. Thanks for watching. Good night.